Yep, this is the first date, uh, update on uh, Aristoteles, the modular project. Um, and so far I've made the uh, the mixer part, uh, which consists of eight channels with, with a uh, volume control for each channel and um, kind of a simple bandpass, low-pass-ish filter, uh, which sounds quite characteristic, quite funny, and a diode for each channel, so you can see when you patch into uh, the channel with from the other modules, and you have a um, main volume control for all the channels here, goes to a, a large uh, jack plug, and this is the power supply, I have this funny security button here, and the staff button, and starving for, for the power for all the other modules. Um, inside, this is the board for the mixer. And as you can see, there's quite a lot of uh, connections um, for each channel. Because um, we have the green wires goes to the LEDs and the yellow ones are connections for filter on off switches and uh, the plug, the, the banana plugs out and uh, we have the red, red ones going to the uh, the potentiometers for the filter and the volume control. So there's a lot of wires here um, and so far it's just the mixer part but I would say it's the most complex board of all of them and you have the power board right here which is quite simple you can see if we so far I don't have a power supply so I've just uh, I just run it off a 9 volt battery it all runs on 9 volt um, and the, the oscillators aren't made yet so I've um, I've uh, built a little uh, test board here with just one oscillator so so we can test the mixers here today um, so yeah let's try and power it up you see this is the power button and it has a LED when it's on which is quite nice um, and you see the oscillator up here is um, it's on right now if you can go a close to it I have to zoom if I have yeah it's to cool maybe stand here just yeah it's quite quite dim right now oh. but you can see it's it's on um, um, so the idea is, and for the oscillators, when it will be done, up here you have a frequency uh, knob, and this is a momentary button, which uh, with this knob here, you can say if it's uh, constantly on, the oscillator, or if it's going to be uh, momentary, so you can like beep, 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 or beep. And here you will have a range uh, switch, so it's like low, mid, high range for the um, frequency. And this will be the pulse width modulation. You can see the, the, the LED here, if I go down, you can see the LED is, it determines how long it will be on and off for. So right now we can put it all the way down. Um, so yeah, let's try and patch it in. So we take the banana plug here, we take it down to the uh, mixer. We'll need some sound, of course. I can turn it all the way down here with the main volume. So we have our... Oh. Yeah. And here the LED responds to uh, whatever is going in, so you can see. Zoom here. Mm. Here it's What's that? 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 Ja, det er det faktisk. Nu prøver jeg at stå her, hvor jeg står. 
så står her, ja. Det ser jeg for. Ja, så kan se det. So you can see the, the, the LED in the mixer channel. It uh, tells us that there's a sig signal through, so you can... And then, if we turn on the mixer, or the, uh, the filter, you can tell that the the frequency is uh, the spectrum is changed in some way. And the volume. Stackable bananas, so you can put it into several other channels. This is a little bit brighter, this LED. I don't know what's wrong with the first LED, it's not that bright. You can plug it into several. This is the start button over here. For the uh, oscillators, I'll have. This will control all the oscillating modules when it comes to that. This is a staff for the power. So that's so far. Let's touch up. 